I've had a very unusual career path. I grew up in Minnesota and Michigan in the cold and the snow. I was a bookworm who read more fantasy novels than I care to admit. People kept asking me, what are you going to do when you grow up? And I honestly had no idea. So I got a chemical engineering degree that I've never used. And then I got a master's degree in Arabic because I loved learning languages and experiencing other cultures. But when I needed to get a job, I started doing technical writing for a computer company. While I was there, I started learning how to write computer code, and then I became a computer programmer. I also love scuba diving and have been diving since I was 10. When I was working for a while in Egypt, I flew down to Djibouti because I really wanted to go scuba diving with whale sharks. Whale sharks are the biggest fish in the world. Adult whale sharks grow upwards of 50 feet long. And on that dive, I saw my first whale shark. I got to swim around with it, and there was a spark in my brain that let me know that I should do more of this. So in the fall of the next year, I went on a whale shark expedition to Baja, California. After a week waiting around to see a whale shark, I struck up a conversation with this biologist who was on board. He was there to try and tag a whale shark to study their population. And he explains marker capture to me using a little plastic tag. And I remember thinking, that is so inefficient and it involves spearing the animal. There has to be a better way to do this. And that was right at the advent of digital photography. I had a new digital camera that I brought with me when I went scuba diving. And I knew other divers did too. I wondered if there was some way that we could use photographic data to tag a whale shark. And the idea for Wild Me began to form. 